drop-off of a package in Chelsea. Well, she followed a resident into the building when the confrontation happened. That neighbor blocked her way and then kicked her in the stomach. And that delivery worker speaking exclusively tonight with Eyewitness News reporter Sonia Rincon. She says it left her with a sprained wrist. Johnson was trying to leave a delivery behind the vestibule door for the woman's neighbor who wasn't answering. And the woman would not let her, telling her to get out and threatening to call 911. She said you're going to call 911 because, no, because I won't get out of her a building. This is scary. scary. Because I was in a work mode, I was just like, let me just record because if anything, if, if she tried to say that I said or did something, let me just show that I'm just working. You should be, but you should have never put your foot on me. Johnson was working as a courier for a company that delivers items like meal kits and pet supplies and posts them on the platform Workwhile. This was on June 19th, Juneteenth of all days. She had a wagon full of packages and the neighbor eventually did show up to claim his. She never apologized, never says anything. She followed me in and she won't get out. She's, so nobody buzzed her in and I'm just trying to protect the place. Protecting the property? From we're not showing you the face of the woman in the video because we've been trying to reach her for her explanation as to what happened and because she has not been charged, though the NYPD says the investigation is ongoing. Johnson says her sprained wrist is keeping her from working and she'd like the woman held accountable for assault. Because if the shoe were reversed, I wouldn't be standing here talking to you. I would probably be at, at, at a precinct already arrested, already, you know, probably need an attorney. In Chelsea, Sonia Rincon, Channel 7, Eyewitness news. And there's still much more news ahead. I would just use at six begins right now.